everyone and welcome to another video now the good days are back and they are called the track days now you join me at the 9th degree supercar club event now you may remember that this club is pretty famous about doing every single time a track day now i am at the autodrome the dubai autodrome and this is where about i didn't even count but probably around 50 supercars for sure and i'm gonna take you all down and i'm gonna show you all because this season there are new cars that have turned up and quite a bit of did you see that porsche gt3 and a ton of different cars that have joined the group again and i'm going to take you all and i'm going to show you all everything that is new and without wasting much time let me start showing you all the new cars so i'm going to start pretty quickly with all the cars out here and you've seen the svj that has featured before that is a 570 s mclaren that is a gt2 rs gt2 rs all these cars have featured before there's a gt3 rs with a fiber uh, uh, carbon fiber bonnet and then there is a hurricane lamborghini hurricane really love the the design on this one then there is a mclaren 570 gt then there's lotus evora there's another gt3 more gt3s that's a gt4 that's a gt3 rs remember i went on a track day with the guy and that's another that's a cool bit of livery by the way nice one and then ah, check out on this corner there is a hurricane that is 812 super fast and the usual but there is a big change in this car which is the corvette c7 of mr faris now faris you may know we we usually go around on the track days but let me show you something special this time it has 850 brake horsepower i'm gonna try getting him on board as well and discuss what's the project about and what has been done to it lotus exige then a wiper now this is something new that has joined another lotus then this is a 360 a ferrari 360 hopefully we'll see it on the track in its full glory there's another Porsche that I really wanted to show you all and that is this. Check that color out. It's the GT3, the 2.0, but look at that color. In fact, look, there are two. The GT3 RS and that's a pretty cool paint and some white rims, but this, oh my God, look at that. And then there's a pinstripe with a gray color and honestly in the sunlight, it looks pretty amazing then there's an aston martin stall which is a db11 v8 and then there are uh, there's another db11 so two db11s and then there is a vantage that has been put up out here then there's an r8 now check out this 911 turbo and check out the livery by the way look at that that is pretty cool then there is another three, uh, F340, the Ferrari 340, and that's a convertible, so which is the Aperta version, and then there is another GT3 RS, and then the Lotus, and there are a ton of Lotus by the way, and this time around there have been a lot of Lotuses, this is the GT430, and this is the 410 Sport, then the v10 r8 and then again the evora check this one yes this is what i was looking for i think i went before but i didn't show you guys again anyways just check that out this is the 600 lt my goodness look at that complete carbon fiber the mirrors are carbon fiber and the best part check out the rims they look really cool another gt2 rs in a stunning color but check this one out and the famous dual exhaust now these dual exhausts are mounted in order to create a low pressure area behind the wing so you get a lot of downforce and that is the reason they've been mounted on top instead of the conventional position out here but 
Oh, look at that. Even the, the, the rims at the back are big ones. And I think these are the 23 inches or maybe 22. Don't know, but uh, it's probably a 22. And they look pretty stunning. And look at that gap. Look at the level of detail, aero detail. Check that out. Check that out. And the paint is shimmering in this sunlight if you can see i don't know if my camera can pick up but everything else is carbon fiber carbon fiber and this is the convertible so 600 as the spider and that's the same gt2 that we saw a while ago it's just turned up and <laughs> i think this all these cars when they are going to be on the track it is going to be a pretty mad event now check out what just turned up utterly insane but pretty cool Harrogan and I'm guessing this has been completely customized look at those wraps and look at those stickers oh my god that looks pretty insane pretty insane love the detail the orange and the orange caliper and the orange striping on the tire and this sort of dot kind of pretty cool looks really mad and I think it's all inspired from a fighter jet because you can see the stickers they've noted out here danger and keep take, keep clear of intake when engine running. I'm sorry I'm a little distracted because there are just way too many cars out here. And look at that, look at that, look at that 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 thing written danger jet blast. Amazing. It's been so tastefully done and if I'm honest, this is by far the best car that I have seen in the parking lot currently and that's the GT3 RS but oh my god this car wins for today for sure behind if you see there is a Ford GT this track they just got even better out of this world now look at this wow apparently this car is for sale and what a color I think white and check out the headlights and look at that cluster it's this this, this is this is like so cool look at those vents aerodynamic and look at how low the car sits it is so close to the ground and wow take a look at the back oh <laughs> this feels so new this feels brand freaking new it's in fact even got carbon fiber wheels check that out this has been tastefully spec this has been tastefully spec what a car <laughs> all right so here we are as promised in Faris 
Z06. Now a lot has been changed from the last time as you may remember as I showed you. There's a sticker behind which says 850 brake horsepower. Now if I remember you had told me you were going to tune it. Yes, so we had tuned it to uh, just under 850 horsepower, 850 torque. Okay. And, and the way we perform it. And uh, we had an engine uh, uh, well, um, oh, okay. For the lifters, um, oh, okay. And uh, we tuned. Um, it's, uh, it's now running okay. Uh, okay. previous uh, the power that already was being developed in the car so we had uh, oops sorry can't talk and drive at the same time but, it's uh, it's so true it was, uh, the standard is 650 and 650 torque uh -huh. and then uh, we took it out to under 800 and the second tune was just over 850 okay just under 850 sorry Ah, okay. Eight, uh, but do you have to change a lot more inside if you tune it to 850? Sorry, say again. Uh, do you have to change a few more components? No, it's, when just, you... uh, it's just a dyno tune. That's it? Yeah, just a dyno tune to take it up to 850. Yeah, so the ECU, that's the tuning that you do. But then that's pretty good because this car comes standard like the components are enough to go up to 850 in that case yes it is um, so uh, we've, we've changed the headers the lower pulley and uh, the uh, the air intake uh -huh. and this is uh, and the dyno tune obviously once you change the air fuel mixture this is what uh, gives it more power it's gonna take a while because it's too loud Hang in there. incredible start to the track day if I'm honest and there have been tons of these cars that have been on the track and they are still going in in fact that's the GT3 and this car right behind the Corvette Z06 it's an insanely fast car and after the tuning it's a pretty pretty mad car because on the track you can feel the extra horsepower that there was just too much of horsepower that was going through. I don't know how the car was able to transfer all of the, that power into the wheels and then onto the track itself, but some of it was doing and this car is just leaving. Anyways, the track day is coming to an end. Not for a few, but, but for majorly, everyone is going back home now, but the track day is still on for another hour, but I think it is super duper hot. I must say that, and that is the reason why everyone's just leaving give it a thumbs up if you like this video and make sure to share and subscribe for more videos to come now if you want to subscribe click here and if you want to watch more videos then click here anyways until we meet next time bye bye